Hello, so we are here in Hiroshima. We're back here again. And for today, we are going to... So, today we are going to be taking a tour inside the castle here in Hiroshima. And um, yeah, we're, we've been talking about it for a while that we are very... Um, curious about what's inside the castle um, we just we parked far away so it's taking us about three it's gonna take us about three blocks to get to the spot so we'll see you guys inside once we get there this little park right here right behind me there's a lot of um, locals you know are on their phones and at first we, I was wondering if there's something if there was a little festival or something going on inside the park but me and my wife just realized that it's actually a big Pokemon hotspot in here. So I'm seeing about a hundred, no, probably like less than a hundred people just on their phones flocking, trying to catch that Pokemon. So it's just a little funny thing to share with you guys. So that's Japan for you. So to get to the other side of the street, we are taking the underground um, path again, and uh, it should be a lot easier this way, a lot safer. And uh, yeah, another cool thing about being here in Japan. So I'm coming out from the tunnel, and <clears throat> I'm already uh, I'm already at the other side of the street, and um, I'm close to the castle now. So I'm, I'm excited how the castle looks like inside. And look at my shirt, there's different fancy book and this is my uh, logo right there. And we're about to get excited to go. <clears throat> so me and Adriel are standing right in front of the castle, right in front of the entrance. So we are going to slowly and quietly walk inside and uh, check out the interior of the castle. Let's see. So I just made a terrible mistake. I forgot to forget to take off my shoes. So next time if you guys come here, don't forget to take off your shoes.
So that building behind me, I thought that was the castle, but um, my wife just my wife just explained to me that um, that's actually um, part of the establishment. It's like a, a gate to protect the main building, which is the castle. So I got a little bit I got a little bit excited, and I thought I was inside the castle already, but that was funny. I thought I just want to share it with you guys. So I'm walking towards the 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 main building now which is the castle and um, I'm so excited can't wait to see what's inside um, growing up I've watched a lot of Japanese movies I played a lot of Japanese samurai ninjas um, PlayStation games um, like Tenchu and uh, like Rikimaru and um, being here takes me back to those um, childhood those great childhood memories and um, yeah can't wait to be inside again. So I'm finally inside the castle, and um, it cost seven dollars for me and my wife for the ticket. So roughly, we paid three dollars for each adult. And um, I'm glad I don't have to take my shoes off. Um, so I'm checking if the castle looks exactly the same how I picture it in my mind. So I actually made it. I'm on. I'm on the fifth floor of the of the castle. Um, I just took five different levels of stairs, and um, the castle is not what I really expected. Um, what I had in mind. It's it's more modernized. It's like a museum inside. All this very well kept. It's very clean. I was um, expecting of a um, like an old, weary castle. Well, like, like, which is very traditional, culture-like. Um, anyways, um, it's still a wonderful experience. It's my first time being inside a castle, and um, it's definitely um, a, a recommended place for every tourist if you come to Japan, especially if you come here, here in Hiroshima. And it's a very, very wonderful experience. So I'm actually here at the rooftop. It's just the fifth floor, the last floor of the castle here in Hiroshima. And um, actually, the ambience here 
is very breathtaking. Yeah. You can see the whole, uh, you can see the skyline of the city. Lots of buildings, beautiful surroundings, beautiful view. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna show you guys what I'm looking at right now. So outside the castle, you have a you have a big courtyard, it was full of trees and um, stones, ruins. Before you get to the castle, and my son Adriel, he said he's tired, so he wants to get on my back so I can carry him back to the ice cream spot and all the way to the parking lot. As you can see, my wife, she is doing her own vlog too. So I'm gonna show you guys a 360 view of the courtyard outside the castle. That looks nice. And also, the best part about this trip is we are not that far away from downtown. So we're gonna go head out, grab something to eat, grab some dessert, do a little shopping, and um, it was a great experience to sum up this trip at Hiroshima Castle. It's three dollars for per, it's three dollars to get in for the adult. It's three dollars to get in for the adults. Uh, kids are free. I forgot what age. And um, the castle is a five-story building. And it's very mod, it's very modern inside. I expected a very traditional, cultural-like. Um, interior, but it's all right, and um, it's a great experience. It was my first time being inside the Japanese castle. Felt like it took me back to my childhood years when I used to play Japanese games, uh, PlayStation games, and now we're down here at the main entrance. Grab some ice cream. See you guys. Inside.